Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Oliver Free, and today we'll compare speed test between these two devices. On the left side we have Samsung Galaxy S20 FE and on the right side we have Xiaomi Mi 10T Lite. So let's quickly boot them up at the same time and see which one is quicker. 3 to 1. Cool. And like always guys, if you are new to the channel, subscribe will be really amazing. This S20 FE is just to mention Exynos one, so it's not a Snapdragon, which is really sad for me, but it is what it is, like I say, every time. Let us wait and see the results. And like always guys, if you're new to the channel, subscribe will be really amazing. The winner with boot up in boot up test is S20 FE, and I give him the case right now he deserves that so there is no scratches okay that's it and there is meat and tea light way more behind guys i will set the brightness mm -hmm. a little bit up something like this and let's put the case also on this one and I will show you the latest software updates on both of these two devices, so there is no difference between them. So let's unlock this one. Check that everything is closed in the background. It is. Go to settings. About software. This one. Software update. MIUI. Download and install. And you can see both have the latest one. Let's go back to home screen. Clear everything from the RAM. Show that again, and we can start right now with phone. S20 FE, messages, S20 FE. Let's go back, what about Play Store? S20 FE, let me slightly down this one, or both, yeah. Let's go back, we have YouTube. S20 FE, definitely, but, it's not a big deal. Let's go back. What about settings? S20 FE, slightly faster. Facebook. S20 FE. Let's go back. We have WhatsApp. S20 FE. Viber. S20 FE again slightly faster. Instagram, definitely S20 FE slightly faster. Wish, it's okay to be like this, you know, they are not even close in terms of chipsets. So basically, S20 FE must be even faster than this, but it is what it is, guys. Jetpack Joy, right? This Meet and Light is still really, really close, guys, every single time also in this game not a big deal for me you know for you maybe but for me it's a not s20 fe and there is meat and light. Like I said, it's uh, not a big deal in terms of speed. Angry Birds 2. S20 FE again. Let's go back to home screen. Subway Surfers S20 FE, slightly faster and Let's go back to home screen Temple Run 2 S20 FE Let's go back to home screen. 
among us. Definitely faster on my feet. Much faster this time, yeah. Color switch right now. S20 FE. And right now we have this 3D Mark Y live test where we will find out which of these two uh, guys are better in terms of graphic performance. So by that you will get the point which one is better for PUBG, Fortnite, League of Legends, Mobile Legends, whatever you want to play, which one will be smoother. So let's go right now. And like I said, this is Exynos um, S20 FE with Exynos 990. Like every single Exynos, like every single last 20 FE Exynos variant. Let's just tweet and see the average frame rate for this test. So these are the results. You can see 25.8 frames per second on average on this S20 FE Exynos variant compared to only 6.7 frames per second on average on this Mi 10T Lite 5G. So basically that means that S20 FE will be much much better in terms of gaming and it's like that but this S20 FE is uh, like to, you know, a thermal throttle a lot. So basically, um, you know, for first couple of games, it will be really great. But after that, you know, it will just go down a little bit. So if this one was Snapdragon 865, it will be even better. That's, that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you very much for watching. And, you know, like always, we will see you in the next one. Peace.